I will never go back to the ANC. Even if politically I was to be persuaded, my grandmother, who is 87 years old, told me that even if she dies, I must never make a mistake of going back to the ANC. So I've never disrespected personally the wishes of my grandmother. It will never happen. Under no circumstances will I go back to the ANC. I will never go back to the ANC. I will rather leave politics and become an analyst at Power FM. <laughs> because I analyze better than many fools that they call here on ENCA and all of that. They don't know politics. And it looks like they are paying them. I don't know. I will analyze free of charge because I love politics. I won't make anyone pay me for analyzing and telling them what they want to hear. I'll give them an objective analysis. Of Unacceptable one is done by blacks. Capture remains capture. Worse, even if it's done by whites. We have captured our country for a very long time. Rupert, they are all celebrating. I've never seen captains of the industry so happy in a long time. They are now manipulating rents to show some strength. There's no strength of anything there. It's a manipulation mm. by white capital to create an impression that Ramaphosa is the angel we have been waiting for. Mm. Once white, white, white capital praises something too much, mm. then you must begin to doubt it. There's something wrong here. Mm. When they expelled us, we had accepted and wanted to walk away until we were misled by Cyril who wanted to shine and give Zuma an impression that he was on his side by expelling us. At the center of all those shenanigans was the big stomach Gwede Mantash, the initiator, the man who spent sleepless night to ensure that we are out of the ANC. So why would you come to me and tell me to come back to the ANC, which is led by the people who are at the center of our suffering? Cyril, Derek, Gwede. Zuma agreed with them because our youth league approached Zuma and said, we initially agreed that you will serve only one term. You must leave as a president of the ANC when we go to Mangawu. Zuma thought we were joking. We went to the NGC and won all the debates in the NGC. And Zuma saw the signs on the wall that these people are going to remove me because they won over the NGC of the ANC. That's when he joined the chorus of us being removed from the ANC. Initially, he was not agreeable to it because he thought our request to remove him was just a, a, a bluffing stance we had no numbers, we didn't have the necessary influence. He was the most influential person in the ANC. But the NGC then gave him a wake-up call. And then he joined Gwede. Gwede didn't want us because we said he must be replaced by Figile Mbalul. Gwede said to Andile Lungisa, if you chase me, I will chase you back until to the sea. He took that vow. Cyril joined the whole thing because he wanted to be in the good books of Zuma. But also, Cyril's father, Rupert, said the youth league <laughs> was an irritating mosquito in a room and it needs a...